Hello dear students, welcome to our channel Pharma Creations. Today we are going to discuss the MCQs of pharmacy practice that is PP703T. So this is the debate question paper of summer examination 2022 and we will see the complete question paper and the MCQs and their answers. So here is the MCQs. First one MCQ is the consumption of a drug apart from medical needs or in unnecessary quantities is option a is drug misuse option b drug habituation option c drug abuse and option d is drug addiction so here if we see the meanings of these terminologies drug habituation is nothing but the psychological dependence for the drug drug abuse is the meaning that is regular or the repeated use of that substance and person is using the drugs for physical and mental satisfaction that is called as a drug abuse and drug addiction is nothing but the inability to control the use of drug or medicine and here the first one terminology is given that is drug misuse so it is nothing but the consumption of a drug apart from medical needs or in unnecessary quantities so here the correct option is drug misuse so option a is correct next mcq dash dash is an example of x category drugs option a is diclofenac b ranitidine c lorazepam and d is the aspirin so here diclofenac ranitidine aspirin these are the otc drugs and whereas lorazepam is the x category drug which can be sold on the prescription of medical practitioner only so here option c is the x category drug that is lorazepam next mcq dash dash is contraindicated during pregnancy due to its teratogenicity option a is folic acid b calcium c retinol and d is iron so the component which is contraindicated during the pregnancy due to its teratogenic effect that is your retinol so option c is correct next mcq which of the following drug does not require therapeutic drug monitoring option a is digitoxin b gentamicin c phenytoin and d is the paracetamol so here the drug which does not require the therapeutic monitoring includes paracetamol because digitoxin gentamicin and phenytoin these are the drugs which requires the therapeutic drug monitoring so here the correct option is paracetamol which does not require the therapeutic drug monitoring next mcq what is the full form of dot option a is direct observation therapy option b district operation therapy option c district observation treatment and d is the none of the above so the full form of dot is nothing but the direct observation therapy so option a is correct next mcq the hospital formulary consists of list of dash dash in hospital option a is instruments b is drugs c is staff and d is the patient so here hospital formulary is nothing but the list of drugs or the drug components or the drug products so here option b is correct that is drugs it does not involve the list of instruments staff and patients so hospital formulary is mainly consists of the list of drugs and drug products which are mostly used in the hospital for the patient health next mcq patient counseling helps to option a is no chemical structure of drug option b develop business relations with the pharmacist option c motivate the patient to take medicine for improvement of his or her health status and option d is all of the above so here the patient counseling helps to know the chemical structure of drug whereas the use of this chemical structure is not there for the patient develop the business relation with the pharmacist is also not the aim behind the patient counseling whereas Patient counseling is definitely helping to motivate the patient to take the medicine for improvement of his or her health status. So option C is correct. Next MCQ. Which of the following causes pharmacodynamic drug interaction? Option A is gastric motility changes. Option B is stimulation of metabolism. Option C alteration of pH of GIT. And option D is interaction at receptor site. So here the main cause for the pharmacodynamic interactions is interaction at the receptor site because where the action of drug is taking place so it is nothing but the pharmacodynamic drug interaction which is occurred at the site of action so here option d is correct that is interactions at receptor site 
नेक्स्ट एम सी क्यू डैश डैश इज द साइंस एंड एक्टिविटीज रिलेटिंग टू द डिटेक्शन असेसमेंट अंडरस्टैंडिंग एंड प्रिवेंशन ऑफ एडवर्स इफेक्ट्स और एनी अदर मेडिसिन रिलेटेड प्रॉब्लम ऑप्शन ए इज फार्मेकोविजिलेंस बी इज क्लिनिकल ट्रायल सी इज ऑब्जर्वेशनल स्टडी एंड डी इज द क्वालिटेटिव स्टडी सो हियर द साइंस एंड एक्टिविटीज रिलेटिंग टू द डिटेक्शन असेसमेंट अंडरस्टैंडिंग एंड प्रिवेंशन ऑफ एडवर्स इफेक्ट्स और एनी अदर मेडिसिन रिलेटेड प्रॉब्लम्स that are involved in the pharmacovigilance it is not related with the clinical trial it is not involved in the observational study and it is not the qualitative study so it is the definition given for the pharmacovigilance because it is the science and activities relating to the all these detection assessment understanding and prevention of adverse effects next mcq the drug should be included in formulary by the name option a is proprietary name b is non proprietary name c generic name and this is the brand name so drug which are included in the formulary by the name which is a brand name all the drugs which are included in the national formulary are of brand names next modem system of medicine is pro- popularly known as dash dash system option a is allopathic b is homeopathic c is allopathic and d is homeopathic here only two options are given that is allopathic and homeopathic which are by mistakenly repeated over here allopathic and homeopathic so if you see the meaning of modem system of medicine and it is popularly known as allopathic system of medicine so option a is correct next mcq the objectives of ptc is or are option a is advisory b is education c is drug safety and adr monitoring and d is the all, your, all of the above so here the objective of ptc ptc is nothing but the pharmacy and therapeutic committee and it involves objective that is advisory education drug safety and adverse drug reaction monitoring so last option d that is all of the above is correct next mcq dash dash should prepare the minutes of committee meeting and maintain the permanent records of the hospital option a is secretary b is joint secretary c is chairman and d is none of these so here the person who is involved to prepare the minutes of committee meeting and maintain the permanent records of hospital is secretary so option a is correct next mcq all order for narcotics sedatives and hypnotics must be written every dash dash hours option a is 6 hours b is 12 c is 18 and d is the 24 hours so here all orders for narcotics sedatives and hypnotics must be written by every 24 hours so option d is correct next mcq drug information services can provide information regarding option a is poisoning b is treatment c is toxicity and d is the all of the above so here drug interaction services it provides the information regarding all of these that is poisoning treatment and toxicity so option d is correct next mcq prescription and medication order are the primary means by which the prescriber communicate with option a is nurse b is doctor c is pharmacist d is none of these so here the prescription and medication order are the primary means by which the prescriber communicate with the pharmacist so option c is correct next apnea is term related to option a is pain in joints b is falling of hair c is abnormal rhythm of heart and d is the transitory cessation of breathing so here the apnea is the term which is related with the transitory cessation of the breathing or the respiration so option d is correct next mcq lack of information may lead to option a is therapeutic failure b adverse effects c additional expenditure and d is the all of the above so lack of information may leads to a therapeutic failure also it also results in the adverse effects and also it may leads to additional expenditure so here lack of information may leads to all of these so option d is correct next mcq ambulatory patients me are option a is in patients b is out patient c is admitted patients and d is the emergency patients so ambulatory patients are nothing but the out patients who can take the treatment and they can go home for their rest so option b is correct next mcq which of the following drugs included under controlled drugs option is opium derivatives b is barbiturates c is amphetamine d is all of the above so here the drug which are included under controlled drugs are includes opium derivatives morphine codeine these are the drugs which are included under controlled drugs so option a is correct that is opium derivatives 
in this way we have discussed the mcqs of pharmacy practice from summer examination 2022 this is the complete question paper of this examination these are the long answer questions and along with that short answer questions are also given over here you can write it down for your reference and you can study accordingly for your sessional and semester examinations this is the complete paper of pharmacy practice for semester 7 for any query you can ask me in the comment section like share and subscribe to this channel share these deba to question papers to maximum students so they can study accordingly for their examinations you can also refer my other videos on uh, mcqs and question bank series unit wise question bank series is also provided to you Thank you so much for watching this video.